And we're back at the ESPA 2012 Exposition at the IBSS Group booth with Vincent Carlino. Vincent's going to talk to us about his latest innovation. Vincent, go away. Yes, hello. Uh, my name is Vince Carlino, and I'm the president of IBSS Group. And I'd like to tell you about uh, our in situ plasma cleaner, which can also be turned into a benchtop plasma cleaner. Actually, it's not a real plasma cleaner. It's a downstream plasma cleaner. There's a technical difference between that, and we can tell you all about that in detail with our brochures and our information. But the way it works is that this device and this device fit on to the electron microscope, and when it is turned on, it creates a plasma in the source, and what is downstream is the downstream plasma. And in the downstream, we do not have any charged particles. We have all, neutron, uh, all neutral particles, and especially atomic oxygen. And the atomic oxygen is what removes the hydrocarbons. It removes the hydrocarbons from both the gas phase and the sample surface, as well as desorbed hydrocarbons on chamber surfaces. This ensures very thorough cleaning of the whole chamber so that the specimens don't get recontaminated by gas phase hydrocarbons. And it simply works by having a controller, a source, and a chamber. This chamber is, can be an SEM, it can be a FIB, or it can also be a TEM chamber. The source is a downstream source and it operates, has a very broad operating pressure range from two tor down to five times 10 to the minus three tor. This broad operating range allows you to clean your chamber and your samples very quickly and return to the operating pressure in the SEM in approximately two minutes. I will, the timer has turned it off. I will turn it back on by our user installed software. This opens a valve and emits the gas with which we are cleaning with, in this case, it's air and the, the plasma strikes. In this case, it's not striking. Let me do it again. Yes, when you know. There we go. So the plasma developed in here puts atomic oxygen into the SEM, and that's what, re, that's what uh, oxidizes the hydrocarbons and the hydrocarbons are pumped out of the system. Unlike a cold trap where they are frozen to the surface of the system to re-enter the chamber when the trap is warmed. So this is a positive way to remove contamination from the chambers of your SEM, FIB, or TEM. Fantastic. Yeah. Vincent, thank you for your time today. For more information, visit ibssgroup.com.